wonderful scene here at Wembley. An ocean of fans descending upon the stadium for what promises to be an absolutely riveting FA Cup final. It's Manchester City, they face Manchester United, and it's live on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester City up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Into cross into the centre. And still danger here. But hang on, the flag is up. And the keeper can breathe a big sigh of relief. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Rodri plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the park. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Harry Maguire plays alongside Raphael Varane. The tackle completely missed time. And you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Well, you don't really want to be picking up a caution so early in the game, Stuart. Well, he's going to be under pressure now. That was a reckless challenge. He didn't need to make it at all. Firing it towards goal! And just over the bar, really good effort. And the ball back with City now. Oh, great attacking play. Good effort here. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. with United well they might be able to launch a counter attack he read the situation defensively and did his job incisive pass well sometimes you get it right on this occasion he got it wrong and he has to do better than that that's a really poor effort I have to say Coming. Well, that's not how they rehearsed it on the training ground. Yeah, and I'm not sure what was going through his mind there. That was a poor decision to shoot from that distance. himself to the tackle and a throw in now and the free kick awarded to Manchester United into the box it goes it's the 
clearance that was called for. Pressure applied. Rashford. From that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. And that's to go short. Smuggled away. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Chances on. with the ball at his feet. A fine reading of the situation. It comes to nothing in the end. Now the counter-attack looks on. Foden, need to get back quickly here. Opportunity! Well, alas, the finish didn't match the builder. Well, you're absolutely right. Not the finish they were hoping for, but an excellent counter-attack. They really do break forward quickly. Well, I think it's fair to say he's not overly pleased, is he? Well, let's give their opponents some credit. They've made it difficult for Man City, but I think it's fair to say they certainly haven't played with enough urgency so far, and that needs to change here. Scott McTominay. This is Varane. Marcus Rashford. United could get in behind the defence. Now disappointing end to the move. De Bruyne. Oh, great vision. Can he take advantage? And goes for goal! The shot seemed like a good option, but goalkeeper's ball. And the challenge holds them in their tracks. It's going to be United's free kick. <laughs> Attending to his defensive chores. Vardiol. That's a lovely ball. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Just watch this again. Bernardo Silva 
this pass is inch perfect. And the Bruyne strike is absolutely perfect. Pace, power and accuracy. What a player he is. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. And the ball is moving again. So there they are at Stiles. And a long way out. Distance. Well, I have to say that was a really good effort. He struck it so cleanly. chunk of added time here a minimum of five minutes Lindelof advantage Manchester United well they'll see it as very disappointing to give it away as cheaply as that De Bruyne with options like about that pass opportunity here my goodness that save fully stretched he was one for his own highlights reel put in by De Bruyne well, not the best clearance oh he'll take us on off and running again it really was spellbinding what we saw from City in the first half so let's see how the second 45 plays out Rashford getting forward the importance of that tackle cannot be overstated Oh, lovely weighted ball, they might be in, just needs to stay calm. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant, he's so unlucky there. his opponent with ease and I think unfortunately for him the less said about that attempt the better well he had a lot of options there but he's chosen the wrong one that was a poor effort well, they have possession again Manchester United and a short corner let's see well it might still work out for them well it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper an effective challenge The counter chance looks very real. Just 
the challenge that was required. Goalkeeper's ball, the cross delivered too close to him. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Oh, tremendous vision. Oh, keeper dealt with it. going to be United's free kick he's in with a chance opportunity still there Nonsense defensive clearance. Has eyes for goal. United regaining possession. Counter attacking chance. All at all, a broken counter attack. How can he take them on and beat them? Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Well, it's no great surprise. We sort of expected this. Kevin De Bruyne really prospering in this game, Stuart. Yeah, he's done everything you want from a midfield player. He's wriggled out of tight situations. He's played a lot of forward passes and he's also defended well. His assist is just the icing on the cake. Bruno Fernandes has it. And Rashford. Perfect challenge. Mount. Oh, could be. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. The cut back. And the keeper's hand does the trick. Corner given to United. And deciding to go short with this one. Fine cross into the middle. And just wide of the target. Goal kick. Well, I think the goalkeeper had it covered, but it was a decent effort, though. Now, options are plenty. I think that says it all. Ten Hag really does have a great relationship with his players. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Taylor, four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. Oh, good vision. Oh, a magical piece of goalkeeping. 
Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. Such good reactions, it really is. Ten minutes left for play. No possibilities in the centre. Opportunity! Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Scott McTominay. Still possibilities. Well, threat about it. I would like to say the keepers kept them in this game, but I can't see them getting back into this one. And it comes down to the final five minutes. That's first. Really bright looking attack. And a decent delivery. And that was gone, Cooper out of the top drawer it's absolutely remarkable his reflexes were brilliant there and United will switch things around personnel wise and United have the corner over it comes danger still on keeper getting the touch well behind for another corner top-class defending and Edison has somehow kept it out corner kick played in and dealt with it nicely racing forward trying to catch them out Manchester United keep the ball advantage well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Well, he's going to be cross with himself, straight into that human barrier. Corner awarded to Manchester United. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And in the end, and they might be through here. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Lindelof. Get past his man and dealt with decisively by the keeper. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. And now for the moment of confirmation. The trophy presentation. Well, this is what they were dreaming of before the game. To come and pick this trophy up. What a performance from them. Yes, a performance that has impressed absolutely everyone. And now it comes down to holding that piece of silverware aloft. The sweet taste of success. It has been quite the journey. And it comes to an end in style on the big stage. And now the celebrations can begin. Not just the players, but also the fans coaching staff everybody involved with this club what a performance it's been
And now, this is really special, isn't it? The chance to run with that trophy over towards the fans and say thank you and celebrate together. Well, they're absolutely right to do that. The fans deserve to celebrate as well. They've been excellent. They've made so much noise here. Great scenes. players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken well these photos will be cherished for years to come won't they certainly ones to show the grandchildren <laughs>